already have the salmon. Oh, you mean the tentacles? I mean, tentacles will be great once we killed Consulot because we can heal with missiles of them. But isn't Phantom better in general? You can't have both out at the same time. The thing is the Phantom gets my weapons. And I'm a Blood Mage so I can get it back with Blood Sacrifice and obviously Data was brilliant. My tentacles do have some niche uses. The one that switches places with Vela? No, she's not an ally, Raddy. She's a friendly. Tentacles are more tanky. Yeah, but before I have Brilliant, I just use my Phantom for DPS, actually. I'm not gonna try and engage the enemies until I get Brilliant. If I even have to fight till then. I mean, if we can get level 16 without fighting, we might not need any of this. Tentacles could actually be good though for the Arcane Dampener people. They're probably still cast it on the tentacles. But I don't have any damage spells at level 3 right now. Uh, level 4. I definitely need Aeora at some point. Right now it's in my Grimoire, but I might not use this Grimoire. What Grimoire do I have right now? Do I have the Ninagos already? Let me actually see if I have the Ninagos, because I need to use the Ninagos. Where do you even get that? Do you have to buy that? I actually have to align all my spells via the Ninagos right now, and then once I get Agamir's Grimoire, I have to center them around that. Yeah, you do get HP from them. But you need Consort Straining Missiles for that. But yeah, you can pretty much full heal with them because they're ranged. And we're going for a build with like stuff like this and much ranged accuracy. So you can heal a shit ton of them. Hmm. Where do you get the Ninagos spellbook again? Do you buy that? I think you do. The one with the death ray. Oh, that's in that one chest in Arkhamir's vault. Then I definitely need to go mechanics. Yeah. And I thought that wasn't worth the thief's body. And then I wasted my thief's body. I mean, it might still be active though. It has a pretty long duration. Um, so I guess for now we take the tentacles and then we'll change it once we have the grimoire. But yeah, I didn't realize it was an Arkham's Ward. I did run out already, okay. That's a shame. I just have to buy one. That's fine, we have lots of gold. Lots of stuff with stone. Haven't really bought anything except some super cheap crafting materials. Yours. Dario said you know what to do. Andra's asshole. Oh, good thinking. I'm learning a lot. 
She's learning bad words. Damn back. She's learning how to say Andra's asshole now. Get ready for anything. I'm learning a lot. Is that it? Yeah, I'm not gonna go into the next rooms. Mono ID. There's an old temp. Just what the I'll wait here. Come tell me when you. You can take whatever you. You can't flee combat, so stealthing through there is too risky right now. But yeah, sometimes it's really appropriate what Vela says in a specific situation. Or I mean, appropriate is maybe the wrong word, but you know what I mean. Yep, Archmage, with that again. Mainly because I don't want to abuse the tactician thing, because it could be seen as a bug. And while I don't care that much about validation of the run, at the same time, I don't want it to be invalid for such a silly reason that my class was like abusing a bug or something. Everybody shut up! Leave this to Professor Grog! I mean, a run might still get disqualified because a character is called Hold My Beer. We learned that today. Oh, it's a bot server. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. <laughs> Wizard weeps everywhere. Any fights today, hopefully? Nah, I don't think so, Yoshi. I highly doubt it. We're trying to get as high level as possible pacifist before we fight. And we're gonna go to Crookspur, so it's a really long route. Will take quite a lot of time. Stream time. Decadency with the sub. Thank you very much, Decadency. I really appreciate it. Still no emotes. I'm sorry. I really have to talk to Sai about the emotes. I'm really sorry, guys. I'm going to try and get it done tomorrow if Sai is available tomorrow. I try to get it done. I'm a terrible person. Okay, um, I never talked to the sailors. Is it entirely safe to convince them? Like, is the attack option super obvious or is it hidden? Or can it be hidden? Can it be a little bit like I make an aggressive reply that doesn't say attack? Should add some more infos on our stream. Oh yeah, I've done the stuff that's written under my stream. I've done that when I started streaming. I never changed it since then. It should be obvious. Okay, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's obvious. We have high bluff too and all that. Defiance Bay, am I right? So what brings you here, friend? I mean, what scares me right now there's two options that say the same. Should I just look this up? Option two. I do not understand. We have done nothing wrong. 
Oh yeah, the angry ghost. I remember that. <laughs> Joking. There's no. I. It, no. Really? I guess these don't really matter. Back to the ship. All right. Cool. Okay, let's see. I think if we return, he doesn't talk to us. But let's try because the quest says we can. That was pretty easy because all of a sudden I remember that I've done that once before with the ghost. But yeah, it's expert mode and I'm always scared. Because I'm not used to playing on expert mode at all. So I 90% of the time I go by memory. Yeah, it's the same for me actually, Raddy. The only thing I have going for me is when I do something I haven't done before, I kind of remember the dialogue. So since I've done this quest like once, I remember the dialogue because I haven't done it a lot. But the quests I do a lot, I just skip through the dialogue, so those are really scary. Unless I specifically try to remember it for expert mode, which I sometimes do. The wizard, your memory needs to be good to learn every spell. Yeah, I'm a bad wizard. I'm sorry, Archmage. Yeah, I kind of remembered that he would move to the other room. I did get the document. Probably not that. Right, so I guess that's gonna be interesting. I mean, you don't actually need to steal that to read that though. But I guess you need to steal it because you're gonna give it to someone. Good night, Watcher. Oh yeah. We can speak in the morning. So the quest is really confusing here. I don't know, Martino, it's the other guy who's sleeping, so I guess it's just the wrong time. Oh yeah, it's hour twenty-one. Trouble sleeping, Watcher? Me, I sleep like an infant. It's funny, you were sleeping when I left here. I guess he sleeps all day. You can use this to extort him to cooperate. It's not needed, but yeah, sounds helpful. I'm so bad at this. I didn't turn in any of the quests when I was in the gullet.
Yeah, that's exactly what I was gonna say, Raddy. I won in a way because I didn't die. Also, what's up, Megania? Oh, that is true, Bella's still on the bird. She does like to ride that bird. It's gonna be awkward once I change my pet. She's gonna ride a dog. Come here, I wanna show you off. Oh wait, if you scroll in, it doesn't look like she's riding it. Never scroll in. of the gloves what happened to them have we come to this then am i really paying for my own property fine 500 pyres make a right consulate school no i'm not that kind of person Ondra's teach six hundred then. Stop I'm so very done with this. Teaching Vela all these Andra words. Andra's asshole, Andra's teats, what's next? Bertenno has cost me enough already. At least it's over now. At least take your discount as well. If the cupboard doesn't make its goals, so be it. Um We don't seem to need more than seven slate of hand, so I'm not gonna buy these. The sparkcrackers are just pressed, so we don't really need that. Six hundred. You've gained question mark copper. Yeah, that happened before as well. Sometimes both is a question mark. Sometimes it isn't. The <laughs> consort parachute. Yeah, that would be more appropriate. Wait, did I not buy this before? Or did I just overlook it? Or did she actually restock? We've been in a naked taka for a while, yeah, I think she actually restocked. Well, also we needed one. Let's actually buy two, just in case. There's no unique thing in here of this. But that's it, I think. How much gold? I do not know. But I could check if I go to like ship prices. It's really easy to find out how much gold you have. But the thing is, I'm not trying to sell stuff. I mean,. You can check it the same way though. Like you go... Let me show this to you. But yeah, the question marks can be really confusing. Once again, the most annoying thing about them is your resources. But they're question marks. Also, every time there's a loading screen and I get this white screen, I get super scared of game crash. Well, that was really long loading screen as well. Dude, we would lose so much time if the game just crashed there. 
The last time I saved was maybe an hour after the stream started. Because we already had a crash at the start of the stream. So we were, would have lost like three hours there. But yeah, sometimes when I hold tap, <clears throat> like I have this habit of holding tap all the time, but sometimes when I hold tap while there's a loading screen, my little mouse thing gets all, I don't even know what the word, it's like a little loop and the whole thing turns white and it says there's no reply from the app and I get really scared. Your game crashed and it saved just where it crashed. Oh, it didn't do that for me earlier, Decadency. It crashed and I had to reload my old save. So I guess you got really lucky there. Saving once every three hours. Has Diablo 1 taught you nothing? I think I would actually be much worse, even worse at saving if it wasn't for Diablo 1. But I'm so used to auto saves and quick saves and all that stuff. Also saving on Diablo 1 is a lot easier than in this game. It doesn't exit you to the menu. It doesn't take one hour to save the game. Okay. Let's try and get the book real quick before we talk to Akamir. Oh, also, by the way, the OP Grimoire from Akamir, you cannot steal it from him. You could get it by killing him. Um, but I think killing Consort is actually, for the challenge, it's actually easier because you go there for the Brilliant Cloak anyway. And once you have the Brilliant Cloak, yeah, might as well kill console out, you know. Because he's part of the ultimate challenge as well. You have to kill him anyway. And there's no reason to kill Akamir. That clicky sound means it worked, right? So I hope the putty is enough here. There you go. Oh wait, this is not where it's in and this has a higher mechanic check. Never mind. Awesome. Cool, cool, cool. Now we can sp pick our spells for real. Now that we have this. I just might have mispicked a couple of spells. Yeah, like Slicken for example, I picked that. But it's not too bad. Slicks is actually the only thing I picked I shouldn't have picked. All the other stuff is stuff we haven't picked yet, so that's cool. Yeah, it's an awesome grimoire. The Death Ray, when I was playing on turn based and I was abusing the food stacking glitch, I think it did like 500 damage per turn or something stupid. But they did nerf it a little bit on turn base. It used to take more than once per turn. It's not that crazy anymore, I think. And of course, we're not on turn base. <coughs> anyway. The Ray King returns, yeah. Yeah, sorry guys, I almost died there. <clears throat> it sometimes happens. I trust Nekitaka is either a testament to the ancient... I warn you to stay... Sangra, but my estate was at you. I am less pleased. The Circle of Arch Magi wishes for us. The dead fire is a fr... We need your help. The wizard Bikana installed an observatory due northeast of Nekitaka. With a fr I have every reason... Anyway, it turns into a monster. Um, we just leveled, right? Yeah. Wow! We just leveled, 
And this is halfway through again. Interesting. I wasn't even at the palace yet. That was really interesting. Wasn't our palace didn't turn into Golot quests? <laughs> Question marks everywhere. It's so confusing. Question mark kiss meat. Spoiled. I want to eat that anyway, but thanks. Um, let's go here first. Do these two. Then we go to the palace. Then we should be almost done. My mechanics is 8 now, I think. I will see spot it's 10, so I probably should go to the Red Hand Arcaboos as well. I, should you need refuge, mate? Yeah, it's eight without thieves, buddy. They're too lazy to change the string constants to make it without question marks. There's quite a few things that aren't without question marks. Sometimes it's really weird, so in dialogue, sometimes you get like no question marks when it says a number of coppers, and sometimes you get a question mark. It's really weird. Is <laughs> there? See what I did there? Need something? I could save an awful right up that. <clears throat> Oh, we also never talked to very and trading people. That's a lot of XP as well. So yeah. I'm going to use Rekvu's helm. I don't think it's necessary because we're a priest. We get that spell that keeps giving us concentration. So I'm going to use the Deltus Cage Helmet for damage buff. I'm going to show the buff in a second. Once the loading screen is finished. So here this. Gives you concentration every six seconds. That's pretty good. It's still not enough. Fuck. I should have waited for one more level up. But oh well. Thief's Putty is easy to buy. It's fine. No problem, Decadence. See, I always used to use Raku's Helm and all the injury items a lot. But I've never really played a lot of priests before. I played one priest mage before on turn based. But. Some of the priest spells are just really good. That's crazy.
Yeah, turn based would be way too slow for this challenge. Because if we're gonna do the hide and seek strat, because combat doesn't end, we're like gonna be hidden for the buffing phase. Dude, that would take. It already takes quite some time buffing up the brilliant everything. But imagine on turn base having to wait for the enemy turns when they can't see you. And there's like a hundred enemies around you, each gets a turn. It's impossible. I couldn't I couldn't have the patience for that. I tried it for a little bit, but sure. it's impossible. Have you pried any secrets from the under only at least though I look for now? What you hit upon my curiosity. You're if the be sure that I had when it comes to the only I cannot say that I did. does the name started. I sent an expert they were you have the cartographer at Ikera. Then you not before the expedition. We found one mystery here. If the crown at Yeah, it definitely takes a long time. I may have started, you might remember when I started my practice runs, I've done a little bit of turn base and what already turned me off turn based was the fact that you only get 10 seconds per turn. But yeah, the amount of time it takes, that definitely was another factor. And probably the most impossible factor of them all. Well, I should change, change every text and character into question mark. No, thank you, Archmage. I pass. I don't want that in my life. Um, what were we doing? Are we actually done with everything but trading company? I think we are. Are we almost leveled again? We're on level of trading company, but that's the wrong time right now, I think. But it looks like we're done with Nekitaka. If it's not the time to get in there, I might... I might just wait. Because we're not gonna come back for a while. We're gonna go all the way to Crookspur. And from Crookspur, depending on our level, we might just go Hazongo. We actually should go to Hazongo first because it's on the way, kind of. To Crookspur. Yeah, we definitely should go to Hazongo first. Get some extra levels as well. Pretty sure my bluff is high enough already. Yeah. Oh no! My bluff is a 10. I need 11, I think. Yeah, you have to wait a couple of days for the quest, I think, Raddy. I mean, I can try again, but I'm pretty sure you have to wait for a bit. I will try it. We can summon the guards if you want to be difficult, Aimiko. What say? My pe we I wish to. My peated father has fallen while I am barred from the. the but yeah, this should already level us. And I guess we waste another thief body on Rat Hand before we leave. Because on the way back from Crooksburg, I might go to Danage, get Captain's Bankhead online. Oh no, I can't do that. I need to steal the cloak first. Hmm. Some parts of the run are still a little bit shady to me. Like the best way to do it. Oh, also is this guy actually here? Not waste time. Guys, uh, I think I this found room something. typhus already. Ak, Ishtawenu is lucky. I only seized the forgery. The galad is too good for his kind. Yeah, still alive for Gate too, but we haven't really done too much super risky stuff. 
Stealing Scotty's trophy was a little risky because I threw the spark cracker in a bad spot, but it worked out. Jim, I keep this cheap forgery locked in my chest. <laughs> it's good. You're the besides, lying is second nature to the Ranga heir and his ignorant client. This is I can almost guarantee the company will put it to more this, but breaking a contract for diplomacy's sake is simply not done. Okay. But yeah, we've definitely been on a what you could call a boring run, just snake attack I think so far. But I think it's pretty necessary. It's a shame and it even comes to the part where it bores me, but having to start over Duma again and everything would even be worse. There we go, we love it. How much do you know? So yeah, now we're pretty much done here. Valera and Badado and we're done. Yeah, one more point. Sneak attacker, exactly. It's all about the sneak. So now that we have the other grimoire, we know we don't have Polar Viera, so we probably need to get that. At least both tentacles and phantoms weren't wasted. The only thing we'll have to change is the slicking. So that's cool. I can live with that. Oh, I need the pistol. I don't know why I didn't get this earlier. I already have the Scardius trophy. So level 12. Um, I don't know how much XP the family's quest is gonna be. Also, Raddy, do you know all the peaceful solution dialogue or do I have to look it up? Because I've never done it the peaceful way before. Oh, there's loot upstairs. Akira, you return. What say, friend? My village is modest, but you are... I think I know, but don't trust me. I'm kind of just look it up. It's fine. So do you ever sneak into the vault when you do it the peaceful way? Because the only time I ever did that quest is when I sneaked into the vault. But that was where I was able to reload. No, I wasn't actually able to reload. That was actually with my monk, Paladin, the TOI run. I almost died doing that quest because I got drag crash and I had the drug monk. I got drag crash somewhere in the middle of the fight and I didn't realize it until I was almost dead. And I panicked like crazy. But yeah, I did manage to survive that just to die to a trap. Can I talk to this guy already? Oh, that clicky sound means it worked, right? I oh, it's not allowed. That's a massive chunk of XP when you talk to him. Hey, Tigers Alex. The ultimate is progressing slowly. We died once. On the initial first try, but so far we've been avoiding everything we could die to potentially. I'm not even gonna bother with this stuff. Oh, on the roof to rooftop. I think I've never actually been on the rooftop. How do I even get there? this. I died sneaking through the Maha thing. The the ghost area. Like 
before the quest progresses. Um, I have most of my past until Fire Drake worked out. I mean, I haven't done something. I'm gonna do this round. I'm gonna go to Crookspur. So that's gonna be kind of an experiment. But on my practice runs, I haven't done anything further than killing Fire Drake. But up until that point, most of it is clear to me. Once again, the crook spur is new. But I think it should be a good idea. I just don't know for a fact. So we'll see. But yeah, it's... You can sneak to the vault. You pro at ship combat yet. No, we've actually found a way to completely avoid ship combat. So basically the navigator that you buy at Crookspur is already level 4. So there's no reason to really level your crew except for the helmsman. The helmsman would be kind of cool to have him at level 4 too. But I found out that if you get attacked by a ship, if you enter naval combat, but then surrender to them immediately, there's almost no risk of getting shot at. But you get 1 XP for your entire crew, which might not seem like much, but if you kill the enemy, you get 3 XP, so it's not a big difference actually. I'm closer, Watcher. We should speak. Who the fuck are you? Wait, who is that? Seriously. And here I thought Tawenu would hold vigil in the company's stoop. Until the last shard of Audrey oh, is, is she related to that guy? Well, I have no idea why I talked to her, but that's cool, I guess. I think I usually ignore her, because I mix her up with this person. Something like that. You need to only choose the anarchist pass. No, I'm gonna go with the pirates. The Principi, because I want the Scardius Trophy. Oh. What's going here? If they catch you, you will fail the Peaceful Solution. See, that's what I was afraid of, Raddy. So are you saying you have to do the sneaking thing? Because I don't know if I want to do that. Because I'm pretty sure I got caught with my monk. I mean, I wasn't leveling stealths. But. I hate sneaking. It's my biggest weakness. Yeah, there's loot, but we don't want to overdo the whole looting thing. We want to be safe. I want to avoid risky areas with loot until I have my fighting potential online, which is level 16. And even then, we're gonna have to do the console hard thing first. Ado, what brings you to the hall of the Valera? Uh, this is early, the rich oh, he's the wrong guy. I no longer hear the perverted gone. Stick with me and you'll be on the winning. I'm with Oh, so this is where you have to wait a couple of days, alright. So now we can 